Well, Anthony, I actually changed locations, came down here to the river because I wanted to show you just a little bit of the wind we're experiencing. Like you heard from Amelia, very cold. We are, we are getting those windshields. And just take a look out over the water. I mean, look at that American flag flapping in the wind. And like you just heard from our meteorologist, that's what we're expecting for most of the weekend. Now, the JFRD, that's the Jacksonville Fire and Rescue Department, they tell me they always see an uptick in fires during this time of year. The main culprits, officials tell me, problems with electrical wires and then also people lighting fires in unsafe locations. So just like you said, if you're looking for ways to stay warm and you're looking for ways to do it safely, here are some tips for space heaters. Officials say always plug it directly into the wall outlet. That outlet can handle high wattage, so don't use an extension cord and make sure the space heater is the only thing plugged into that outlet. Also, when you're setting up your space heater, put it on the flattest surface possible and in an open area, nothing around it. Now, if you have a fireplace, that's an option to stay warm. But here in Florida, there could be months between the last time you used that fire pit. So it's always important to clean out ashes from previous fires and check the chimney for any animal nest or other blo blockages that could prevent smoke from escaping. And most importantly, use your smoke detectors. Make sure your smoke detectors have good batteries in them, have their in place, they're not disconnected. If you don't have a, a smoke detector, call 630 City. We're happy to come out, give you a smoke detector. We'll even install it for you. Also, now is a great time to create a home exit plan in case there is a fire. You know how to get out safely, you know where the exits are. Reporting in Jacksonville, Tia Collins, First Coast News on your side.